This is the Yigobi computer gaming desk. Let's open the box. Well, even though there was a hole in the cardboard, it doesn't appear that there's any real damage to anything because everything has styrofoam on it. So let's get this opened up. So here's what's in the box. You can see the tabletop, if you will, is all the way at the bottom and it has sort of a Z-shaped frame like that on each side and there is a cross brace that goes across it. There's also a box there which contains some accessories that come with this and it appears that there are holes in each corner of the tabletop where you can run cables down. Now I'm not going to show you how to put this together. It should be self-evident by the instructions. How long it's going to take really depends upon your skill level and the tools that you use. But typically this would probably be, I would rate it probably about a half hour or so to put together. So I'm going to put this together and I'll come back once it is complete. All right, it's coming along. I just wanted to show you the progress so far. I have the cross braces installed as such. This end will be the part that I sit at, so this doesn't get in the way of your knees. I just have it turned around. I have to turn it back around. And then I have to put the top on and add the accessories. The tools you need are included. They're just Allen screws and they give you the two different size Allen wrenches that you need. So now I'll put the top on here and finish up. And here is the finished product. Not bad at all. Seems pretty sturdy. The tabletop of it is 45.3 inches by 27.6. So a little bit more than two feet coming from the wall out and 45 inches or so across. You also get a mount or a hanger hook for a pair of headphones right here and a cup holder and you have your choice of mounting these on either the left or right side. Either one can be mounted. You can put them both on the left side, both on the right side, or one on one, one on the other. Totally up to you. Seems nice and sturdy. Any table is going to wiggle a little bit, but it's otherwise absolutely sturdy and will definitely hold up. Over here, this is just the design of it. You can't put any cables down there, but that's okay because you have the holes here. And they also give you the little plastic inserts for that. So this would just go in here. And then you just push that down all the way. That'll work. And then here is your thing where you can put cables through. You can take that piece out, which is usually the best way. And then this will snap in, which I need two hands for. There it is. And then your cables will run through there. So you pull out the insert, run your big cables through, and then you pop in that, and you're all set. Also included are these cable clips. They have adhesive on the back side, and then you can run the cables through there and clamp them down. Here's a closer look at the surface. It's like a carbon fiber looking type surface right there. All that's left here are the two Allen wrenches that were included and I've mounted up the uh, cup holder and headset holder. Here's the cup holder here. That'll certainly hold a can, maybe a cup or something like that. There's a little wiggle room in there, so I'm sure it'll fit an average size pint glass or something like that. And over here is the mount for the headphones. I opted to mount it this way. It's just easier because you can just hook it on like that, but it does appear that there are provisions for you to mount it the other way around so this hook would be underneath and with that you would then hook it up in there and it would kind of keep it more out of the way I'm gonna leave it like this for now it's very easy to move with just two screws at any time so once again this was the Yigobi computer gaming desk if you'd like to purchase this item I'll leave a link in the video description where you can find it available for sale on Amazon thanks for watching Make sure you click like, make sure you click subscribe, and take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.